medical school advice part two so one thing that i have learned in a very hard way is that i have to you know be confident if i really want a good performance in my exams right now i am a almost to the end of my third year so after two months i'll give my boards and i'll be a final year student and the one thing that i have learned in a very hard way and it's, i think it's one of the hardest thing that i had to learn was to be confident during exams especially practical exam i am that one student who used to give up before exam only that i will fail for sure you know i used to panic so much that you know that used to destroy my performance in exam i used to feel like even i had even i used to even if i used to study i have completed almost like 75 percent 85 percent or even if i have completed everything but my underconfidence was so much that i used to forget everything before entering the exam hall till today i would not say that i have completely overcome it but definitely i have brought a very important and a very um, recognizable change inside of me I try my best to be confident. I try my best not to panic before exam because I know that if I'm underconfident, I will start forgetting everything. I will not be able to perform good and even the slightest error in my performance will make me think too hard for it and ultimately I will, you know, end up giving a bad performance. So guys, please, this is a very this is one advice that I'm giving you from the bottom of my heart. No bye bye teacher, no teacher comes to your exam hall with the intention of failing you okay no teacher has this intention to fail you in your exam in your especially in your practical exam they want you to perform well no teacher in your practical exam wants you to fail they are not there to fail they're just there to test you test your knowledge they will help you as much as they can few teachers might be strict but still they are there to support you they are there to teach you and that is very important to understand because we don't know them so we feel very strange in front of them and we just feel like they will fail us even if we do one mistake but that's not the situation they have also gone to the same phase in their life as like you have gone to the same phase tomorrow if you'll be a teacher you will understand your student right so in that way the teacher will also understand you so do not panic in front of them just cooperate try to remember everything just focus what we have prepared and don't think of the negative result just think what if you do our best just think and prepare for your exam in a positive way. Think positive. Be positive. Meditate. This is just going to change your life. This is really, really going to change your life as a medical student. Not just in your undergraduate, but in your postgraduate and any level. It is going to be very useful for you.